Welcome to Unleash the Awesome with Dave Gambrill. All of us have unique skills, talents, and abilities that aren't being used to their full potential. Our mission is to share the people, tools, apps, and other resources that will help you unleash your awesome on the world. Yo, what's up? It's Dave. Welcome to another episode of Unleash the Awesome. Today, let's talk about being a laser, not a lighthouse. If you think about light, light, right? You can shine a light, you can shine a flashlight. If you have a flashlight, you can, especially if you like a mag light or something like that, you can take that light and concentrate it into a pretty strong beam, or you can back it out a little bit and make it cover more area, but it it's not quite as bright, right? It's not quite as intense. And if you think about that same light, if you concentrated it into a laser, right? If you took all the energy of that light and concentrated it into a laser, it can do some damage. It can cut through things. And depending on the intensity of that laser, it can cut through a lot of stuff. Super powerful, right? And the reason why is because it's a focused beam of that light energy. On the other end, if you think about a lighthouse, while a lighthouse is big and the light is probably bright, it is more diffuse and a lighthouse essentially sits there in a defensive position and shines the light back and forth and basically says, don't hit me, I'm here. I'm over here, but don't hit me. Hey, here I am. Yo. Hey, ships in the night. I know it's foggy, but here I am. Don't hit me. And it's a very defensive position. And while it's effective, it's uh, it's not as focused as a laser. And it can't do the kind of damage that a laser can do, right? It, can't, it doesn't have the same effect. So if you think about what it is that you are doing, are you more of a laser or you're more of a lighthouse. And if I had to guess, because I've been there a lot too, you're probably more like a lighthouse. A lot of the stuff you're doing, you're probably distracted and you're probably shining your light over here and shining it over there and just kind of going back and forth between all of these different things and playing in a defensive posture. P playing safe, right? Better safe than sorry. Honestly, safe is the new sorry. You got to take risks. But that's how a lot of people are hanging out. They're acting more like a lighthouse. And I'm going to suggest to you that if you want to be successful, you got to be more like a laser than a lighthouse. You have to take that beam super intense, concentrate it down. You have to eliminate things that you shouldn't be doing. You should stay hyper-focused on the couple things, the few things that will move the needle for you. And don't just do things because everybody says do things. Don't just start a podcast or write a book or start a blog or get on TikTok or whatever. Like, don't just do things because everybody else is doing them. Then you're more like a lighthouse. You're just kind of going back and forth like, oh, here I'm over on Pinterest. Now I'm on TikTok. Now I'm doing a blog. Now I'm doing a podcast. Look at me over here. Whoa. Right? And you're just too spread out. It's a defensive posture. Pick one thing. And go all in. Get concentrated in that thing. If you're going to pick Instagram, okay, go in there and let's go. Build a following. Obviously, if you've been listening to me for more than five seconds, you need to build your email list as well. right? So if you're going to build a following on one of those platforms, make sure the call to action is to get on your email list. But stay focused like that laser. Stay focused on what it is you're doing. Right, so many people that I run into, so many people that I coach, so many people that I see in my digital marketing mentorship Facebook group, they're over here doing this, and then they're over here doing that, and then they're over here doing this, and then that. Oh, somebody said I should write a book. Somebody said I should do this. I mean, you can do all of those things. You just can't do them all at the same time. You need to stay laser focused in one, have some success at that thing, be able to monetize it. And then take the money that you make from that. And then if you want to go invest it in something else. And I'll tell you, when you have the money, it makes it easy to invest in that other thing because then you can get help. So if you want to write a book, but you have some money, you can invest in a ghostwriter or someone to help you write it, basically. 
right? If you want to launch a podcast, you could bootstrap it and do it yourself. I'm still doing mine pretty much myself, but you could hire people that could coach you through it and produce it for you and everything else. Right, but none of that's going to happen if you expend some of your energy over here and then some over there and then some back over here and then some over there and play in the defensive posture of, hey, I'm a giant lighthouse just shining my light back and forth. Don't hit me over here. All right? No. Get focused. Focused. To me, the word focus is an acrostic for follow one course until successful. Follow one course until successful. So follow one course of action. Find that thing and go do it. Now, doing that one thing may require you to do a couple ancillary things to make it work, but stay focused on that thing. Like, what is it you're going to do? Are you going to write that book? Okay, then write that book. Don't write that book and try to do 80 other things. Are you going to put your course online? Okay, cool. Let's do it. Let's get a course online and don't do anything else until that course is online and it's for sale and people can buy it and people are buying it. If building your email list is your focus, then okay, let's get that lead magnet figured out. Let's get it online. Let's drive some traffic to it, and let's get some people on your email list. Stay focused like a laser. You will have much more success. You can do all of those other things later. You just can't do them all at once, and that's the biggest mistake that I see people are making. They're trying to do so many different things. Oh, but Dave, TikTok's out and it's so popular and I need to get over there and be an early adopter. Uh, I don't, I mean, whatever. I have a, I reserved my username there. That's about all I do on those things. And I started messing around with it a little bit. But like my business is fine and I'm doing okay and I don't have a huge presence there. There's other people that are sprinting over there and doing it and having a lot of success. The ones that are having success are the ones that are focusing on it. The ones that are focusing like a laser on it. They're not vacillating back and forth between different things. The things, the, all the different things are not the things that are going to help you. You need to get your message locked on, your mission locked on, and get out there and do something and make an impact in one spot, and then you can move to the other. All right, so today's episode was a little shorter, but I felt compelled to come on and share this with you because lots of people need to hear it. I needed to hear it again. I've heard it plenty of times, but... You know, sometimes we don't t do our, uh, take our own advice or do the things that we're coaching others to do. And I actually had a conversation with somebody today about this and I was like, Ooh, there are actually some things that I'm not staying laser focused on. I'm more like a lighthouse. So I need to stop doing those other things and go back to getting focused. And it's amazing. As soon as I did that, I felt better. I started seeing results almost immediately. Uh, so I would encourage you to look at those things that you need to get focused on and then get focused and until next time, go unleash your awesome on the world. See ya. Thanks for listening to Unleash the Awesome. Please be sure to subscribe, rate, and review wherever you listen to your podcasts. And please share us on your favorite social media platforms using hashtag Unleash Awesome.